Hey, what is goody? Please don't mind a little baby girl. We have to get this look together with the kids today. So yeah, without further ado, like, comment, subscribe. Let's get into it. Let's get dressed and get ready with your girl. And I'm looking like the baddest, okay? Period. So yeah, like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get into it. Oh, hey, I hey, what is goody, baby? It is ready. It is romance. It's gonna go down today. It's gonna go down today with the makeup. Period. I haven't brought y'all to serve you in so long either. Girl, let me tie my hair up. Cause I'm gonna beat this face. Nah, let's see, let's see. Hey, I hey, what is goody in the hoodie? Um, yeah, I'm gonna get cute. I'm gonna go out for a second. Got some good things to do today. Some people to see, girl. So. We love that. But yeah, I'm trying to get cute. So the vibe for today is purple. I love purple on me. That is the vibe for the look today, y'all. And I am using this palette that is ancient, but it's brand new to the channel, okay? It is the James Charles. Mm. It's the James Charles palette with Morphe Girl. It's brand new. We love that. Um and I'm like, you know what? I need to do something new. So why not dive into this fucking beauty? Um, I'm gonna put a little moisturizer on. Yesterday it was like 100 degrees. So I'm doing my makeup. My baby is in the back if y'all hit stuff. Yesterday was like 100,000 degrees. Primer from Black Radiance. We love that. I'm gonna use one of these babies today. I'm gonna see how it works. We're gonna go with the long lasting. Ooh, they got that shit. Okay, wait a minute. Matte and poreless. Hydrate and blur for sure. Hydrate and blur. We're gonna hop into that. I just did three pumps. Let me feel texture. Oh god, Lord. Yeah. This is for you. It's gonna be crazy. Hopefully, I don't break out. Like, oh goodness. But this is the Black Radiance Face Primer. Oh, it feels good on the skin, Jen. Oh, it feels really good. Yes, baby. Oh, let me see. Oh, goodness. Pray for me, y'all. We doing a tutorial with the baby, Jeff. So, oh, the primer feels really really good okay i'm not mad at that okay so let's get into the brows i kind of want them to be like skinny soft bad bitch so let's hop into that i'm gonna speak this up here and i'm gonna come on back okay okay
Okay, so we are about to go into this palette chair. I know I want some pink in there, so I'm probably going to start with pink as my transition color. I'm always doing pink and purple, like it never fails. Yeah, I'm going to go into this pink shade right here at the bottom, y'all. We ain't going to do too much talking. I kind of want my eyes to be like, whew, like going up a little more. So I'm going to kind of like bring it out, you know. Instead of like down, yeah, I kind of want to break it out. And this is the Morphe um, M505 brush, y'all. But yeah, this whole summer I have not been on no girly shit, girl. I've been wearing dunks and girl trapping and girl having going to dice games, all that type of shit. So I'm like, girl, really, we gotta get back on our girly shit, like, but, so that is the move for today. We is on girly time, okay? I mean, I'm always girly, even when I'm wearing the damn shoes and stuff, but, the real question is, are these shadows buildable? Because, girl, I have to put purple right there too. So I really wanted it more purple, so hopefully it take over. Yeah, I don't want to do too much pink, but I do want the blend to be a flawless bitch. So I'm almost up. I got a bunch of shit I have more. And girl, we finna get the crank and shit out. So I'm gonna go in with that purple shade that is right next to it, y'all. Oh, that's pretty. It's pretty. Um can't even really see it right there but it turned into like a real quick like fuchsia almost and we love that so the thing about shadows y'all i'm not even gonna lie you just want to make sure your shit ain't harsh and that you blending them out at this point I ain't did no color all summer. Now I'm going in with that dark purple. Okay, very good. <laughs> yeah, it's giving. And I'm literally using that same brush, so we definitely love that. Yeah, I'm kind of, you know, <laughs> yeah. What? At first, I'm like, you know what? The outfit is doing a little too much. I'm not even gonna do like bow makeup, but I'm like, you know what? Forget it. Go big or go your ass, huh? Yeah. So that's kind of where I'm at with it right now. Okay. Ooh, girl, I should cut my fucking crease. Psych. Not doing that today. But I have a video coming up and I'm so thirsty to film it. I am going to be cutting my crease and it is going to be so freaking cute. It's going to be so cute. So, um, oh, I need to film that like ASAP. I'll probably do it like next week. Okay, we done with that. I'm about to like, put some concealer on my lid so we can put some shadow on there.
And for my um, lid color, I'm going to go into the um, Magic Palette. And use that like light purple because I don't want to use too many like dark purples. They have this really, really cute holographic purple, but I think I'm going to use it for um, another look up in this palette. going in with this palette now and I'm about to, I'm about to put that purple uh, on my lid this color right here and kill this one y'all it's not focusing but it's called Faso for sure look Well, let me see. Period. So yeah, I'm excited to put my liner on with it and my lashes to kind of pull the look together hopefully y'all don't be looking crazy as hell y'all fingers crossed so now i'm about to do my liner I'm excited for this look. I have no idea no color all summer, so we actually do love that. That baby right here is a true character, I'm telling you. Like, true. You see what I'm saying? So yeah, y'all. So we want to move on to the face, y'all. Koyla Ray has been all over the internet since. Girl, she did the damn cipher. I don't know. I like Koy. Not as like you know when you just like people that you be like, oh yeah, she's a fucking vibe. I like her in that way. I don't really listen to her music, so yeah. But girl, they've been dog walking her since the cipher. The um. What the fuck is that? Um, double freshman, whatever. But girl, they been dog walking her since then. The freshman cipher because yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Her rap was like, girl, you should have did what you needed to do. You know, like, girl, you should have went home and practiced for the recital. Um, so it was not given, but you know, people legit have fun dragging people. Not my cup of tea, but to each his own. But yeah, y'all, so she did the little rolling out set, and they like, girl, like, get it up. And I'm just like, wow, dream killers. Like, people will really try to kill your fucking dreams. Like, yes. The crowd probably wasn't feeling those songs, but that don't mean she should stop, you know, fucking rapping. People just mean, that's how I feel. The industry is just mean. Are they always talking about people? Oh, <laughs> oh, Koi. So, yeah. I've been watching, um, the Real Housewives of Potomac, sure. 
Girl, at this point, I don't know. I do. I like, I like the cast. But yeah, I don't know. You want to know who my girl? <laughs> Seriously, you want to know who is my girl? Like literally, Auntie Karen. Like girl, we love her. Giselle, like I cannot with her. She just so. I'm not gonna lie. She just fake as fuck. I don't like her. And she just, girl, stop sugarcoating this shit. Like, seriously. That's where I'm at with it right now. Like, girl. Like, girl, you sugarcoating your, your life, okay? It's like, don't try to come at Karen and say you don't fuck with her. But all your ducks is not in a row. Like, you know. I love Karen though. She don't care. And I be wishing people like I be wishing everybody had a mouth like us because for one, it makes good TV, girl. It makes good TV. Like when everybody can legit clap back. Cause nobody wanna watch somebody getting fucking bullied. Really they don't Yeah. Nobody wanna watch that. Except for Bad Grip Club. That shit's so 08. Been there, done that. So yeah, but yeah, I'm trying to get into it. We only went two or three episodes in, so I'm gonna come back when we like five episodes in. I'm not even gonna be watching it weekly, but girl, what I have been watching, well, keep it up with you, is when Kendall, Kendall girl, do the fucking love and hip hop. Night and chill, whatever the fuck. Like seriously, I'm not even seeing Erica because she a bully her fucking self. But Safari G, oh baby, oh baby, the man. The man is smoked. Like, uh, what? Gee. And that's why I stopped liking. What the fuck is her name? I don't even remember her name. What is her name? Oh, yeah, Rashida, girl, and Kurt ass. Because they started putting too much of their business on here. Like, it's cool if it's for TV. It's another thing if it's, this is what's going on in the real world. And, girl. Girl, it, it's going on in the real world. Like, sis had her body in safari is somewhere break dancing. I'm talking about sis had her. What the fuck is that? Sis just had her baby in safari somewhere break dancing. So it's a fucking joke. Like, no, you don't do stuff like that. You just do not do stuff like that when a woman is. I don't know, y'all. It don't matter how old these niggas get. Seriously. I have to remind myself this because legit, my mama been told me this. It don't matter how old they get, bro. They are stupid. Like, <laughs> it takes them so long to mature, bro. And that's what I'm at with it, like, Yes, one crazy. We going crazy. So I don't. I'm not at with it with nothing. Like I cannot. I'm not teaching a man how to be a man. And so far, we like you know better. Like this be my thing, y'all. I'm big on my kids. If you're not ready for me, if you got shit going on, if you trying to make something be what it ain't and you know that i was chilling you know like chilling with my feet up drinking lemonade and you step into my life trying to do some shit g and you know you're not ready for it like i ain't gonna lie now i'm on the first 48 because they're trying to figure out who killed you because I never asked you to mess with my piece, bro. So, oh, I feel so bad for Erica. I don't know the history behind it, but baby, 
one baby i already know you know it can be a hot ass mess bitch now you didn't knock me up again and while our baby is in the NICU you is somewhere pop locking oh break his fucking muscle joints why don't you like oh he's a joke and it's just like you asked this woman to marry you like gee I'm pretty sure she didn't get on one knee and ask you. So it's just like, why mess with her pee? Why? Cause you know, we, we really like, and you know, he needed to take a fucking seat because now you running this girl's life. And that's not right. That's sad. <laughs> Cause why would you bring that to somebody else's house? Um, Oh, he's a joke though. Like, even just how he act on like social media, and that's why I just be like, these shows like them, like Love and Hip Hop is embarrassing. I cannot watch it. That's why I only watch Kendall, Kendall, and he be checking shit. But it's just like these shows are so fucking embarrassing because. If this is how your real life is, G, and you airing this shit out for a check, oh, you need a reality check. Because, baby, y'all will do anything for money. My personal life is not worth it. Like, it's just not. My personal life is not worth money. Like, bitch, I'm really going through it. Like, yeah, I can cry shopping, but, bitch, after I'm done shopping, I'm going to still be crying so it's just like no no it's a it's a big no for me safari is mad wrong like safari is dead wrong because that's your wife and then how um well i kind of know it was scripted but at the same time it's just like gee uh that's what i'm saying people will do anything for a check you legit embarrassing your fucking wife on national tv like the face Hi. is coming out legit gorgeous i cannot wait to see though how this fucking makeup holds with this primer that's my only thing girl i'm gonna be drinking looking like yeah <laughs> yeah sashay yeah. away the so far he she talking about he was a mess the first pregnancy like girl I don't know when women are gonna truly understand for real for real that go, go, go. when you have your baby G you have it for you it's no other way to describe it it's sad but you don't know how that man is gonna act once the baby get here and guess what you're gonna have to do regardless yes you're gonna have to stand ten toes because people don't get me wrong Bitch, people be yes, that nigga's a dead beat, woo woo woo, but I ain't gonna lie, motherfuckers be expecting that from the, but when the girl is a dead beat mama, bitch, yeah, when the girl is a dead beat mama, G, you never hear the end of it, like, oh bitch, you never hear the end of it, that bitch is foul, that bitch is X, Y, Z, but when a dude ain't handling his end of the bargain, it's just like, oh, yeah, he a deadbeat. It ain't really too much behind it. Like, it's fucked up, but that's just the way sometimes the cookie crumble. But, yeah, I definitely... Do y'all feel like that, though? Like, when women have a baby, if she was legit acting like a deadbeat mama, she would get more, you know, slander than a dude. Like, I feel like, yes, dudes don't, would not, a woman would definitely get way more, like, harsh everything around her being a deadbeat mama. But a nigga kind of be like, ah, oh, the nigga's just a deadbeat. Like, I feel like that. Do y'all feel like that? Like, I don't know. Like, mm -mm. hold Hold these girls to that same standard. That's why when you have your kid, ladies, you have your baby for you because you don't know. 
See you later. Wow, that's so cool. You don't know how they do on my eyes, so. And now I'm about to brighten up my under eye. Y'all, these flies are coming in through my air conditioner and I'm legit gonna cry any minute now. Like, I cannot. I cannot. I can't. I can't. So yeah, Safari is dead wrong. Just like the situation with Kurt when it aired with Rashida dead wrong. And it always... He's so rude, y'all. It always just falls back on you. Wow, y'all did all of this for a check. Like, y'all aired y'all business out for a check. Certain shit just, it's a no for me. It's a big no for me. But yeah, y'all, I'm just real big on men messing with a woman's peace because it's just like women be so invested in something once, you know, they start taking it serious and it's just like, if that lady was doing fine by herself, gee, why would you come messing with her and you know you wasn't ready? Like, oh, hate that for us. Because we don't just go messing with dudes. Well, I can't speak for all of us because bitch, I don't know what some of y'all be doing. But I'm not just gonna go messing with somebody, G, and I'm not dead ass serious. Like, I wanna be with you. Woo, 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 whatever it takes, bitch. And it don't take nothing for this to be over. So, I would not go messing with nobody's pizza. Yes, call the police. Like, no. Please. Heavy oh. <laughs> on the don't mess with a woman's peace, bro. Oh, but we doing so good, too. Baby. <laughs> Go to hell, okay? my makeup hold up with this primer y'all don't even understand i'm scared of shit <laughs> but black radiance i have faith in you baby we do 
we do. Okay, so let me set my face now. That's funny that you're being reckless in my house. You think that's funny? Okay. And a little razzle dazzle. Okay, so I'm gonna set my face and then I'm gonna do my own body mascara. For me, so yeah, it's not so much, girl. It's a really, really pretty. Like, I love that the eyes are like soft but bold. <laughs> um, so I'm about to do my hair, and then I don't know if I want to put clips in my hair or not, girl. But I'm gonna show y'all the outfit. I'm gonna do my hair. What time is it? Okay, it's 3 30. Okay. I'm gonna do my hair, um, you know, and then we is about to go. Okay, yeah, so this is what I am putting on this little cute little butterfly little set. My Gucci sandals. Do y'all see the nails though? Oh, yeah, play with your mama. Okay, and then I bought this cute ass chain, y'all. I don't know if y'all can see it. Hold on, put it on here. Oh, I'm in love with it. Oh, God. And then I got some looking house. And then I got some butterfly earrings. And I think I'm going to wear that. Pick my hats up, babe. Pick them up. Yeah, the chain is too damn cute. I got me some little butterfly earrings. And then my anklets and jewelry and stuff. So I'm about to get ready. And I'm going to check back in with y'all in a second. Ooh. Okay, y'all, so I am dressed. I don't know how I feel about the chain. Oh, I wish it was just this one. I'm going to try to take it off. But, yeah, I literally look so fucking adorable. Um, So, I'm about to do my look really quick because actually time is a winding down. But, girl, you should have been out the house. So I'm about to do my lip real quick. 
new lip, y'all. Nothing major. I don't know how I feel about the train. I don't, I'm not used to like jewelry like this, so. But I love the butterflies with my outfit, so I don't. I don't know. So I'll figure it out before I leave out the door. I feel like Trina, like I'm dead as peach. <sighs> not with the kids, like not with the kids. You can never fully feel yourself. You can never fully feel yourself with the kids. It's not gonna work. put my perfume on i don't know what i want to smell like today like do I, am i looking for a husband am i looking for a summer fling like girl whatever i put on that's what the fuck i'm gonna attract so i love y'all don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this video girl and i will see y'all in the next one